Dr. Anita, your fertility specialist. Today we will learn quickly about the reasons for male infertility. Male, what is male infertility? That means even after marriage, like one year after unprotected intercourse, after the marriage, they are not able to conceive or bear a child. The reasons can be multiple. It can be female partner, it can be male partner, or it can be combined. So around 30% of the causes for infertility is male factor. So what is this male factor? Mainly male factor is semen abnormalities, semen analysis abnormalities. That is, it can be either sexual abnormalities, erectile dysfunction or premature ejaculation like that. Or it can be production problem like semen. In semen only there can be problems with the production of the semen. Or, or produced semen or produced sperms not able to get secreted that is obstruction so what are the what are the causes for this mainly one is sexual dysfunction that is erectile dysfunction or premature ejaculation the the causes for this can be psychological or it can be organic or neurological causes or it can be production that is problems with the semen that is low sperm production or the sperms are getting produced enough but they are not able to secrete that is obstructive causes non-obstructive and obstructive causes for the non-obstructive causes that is the production itself low that is why the sperm count is very low what are the causes it can be central reasons that is hormonal infections heavy heat all those things and then drugs unnecessary drug usage and like unhealthy habits also like alcohol, illicit drug usage, tobacco, smoking, all these things also can damage the sperm production and unhealthy lifestyles also like sedentary lifestyles, obesity and uh, any genetic abnormalities also there is inherent problems in the chromosomes itself which is leading to all these things so genetic reasons or childhood the person would have suffered some illnesses like high grade fever or varicose all these things and then any tumors also can cause all these problems and all that is one more reason is the produced semen that is sperms are getting produced enough but they are not able to get ejaculated that is obstructive causes what are the obstructive the commonest is the dilatation of the vessels around the testis that is varicose veins we call it as varicose veins this is one of the commonest cause infections and any tumors all these things also can lead to obstructive azospermia or we call it as oligoastenoteratozospermia that is where is low count of the sperms so when to meet a doctor whenever the person is not able to bear a child when to meet when the man can meet whenever he is having ejaculatory issues like premature ejaculation or not able to maintain the erection erectile dysfunction or whenever the semen analysis shows some abnormalities so then also they can have or the patient is having or the person is having some pain or some swelling or uh, some discomfort in the genital regions or any history of previous genital surgeries from the childhood and now he is not able to bear a child that is causing to low fertility or infertility or any infections so these things also can lead to d decreased fertility or he was like alcohol like uh, regularly a heavy alcoholic person or occupational hazards also like a farmer daily or regularly exposed to the pesticides or some other chemicals strong chemicals which can lead to all these problems or heavy irradiation who works the men who work under heated environment like high heat or radiation exposure also like uh, x-rays all these things also can lead to these problems so what we can do whenever you have all these problems or whenever you come across these problems meet your doctor immediately and get consultation and get treated so what next we should do if we are having so one is for everything like healthy lifestyle follow strictly healthy lifestyle like exercise diet management and good healthy habits and wear loose clothes don't wear tight clothes or jeans or anything avoid too much of wi-fi exposure Avoid too much of heat, heat or irradiation. Avoid unnecessary drugs or alcohol and other things. And then uh, too much of sedentary lifestyle also. Always sitting and working. So keep moving around. Be active. Uh, these things can improve so much of uh, semen parameters actually. So meet your doctor and get consultation. 
immediately please subscribe to our gabbagudi youtube channel will you can come across so much of information thank you